Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. How are you? How are you? Fine, teacher. How's everything? Nice? Happy because today is Friday. Uh, finally, but it's a problem because we have a, a classes the, <laughs> this night. <laughs> Okay, and you know it's because we began on Tuesday. We did it yes. Monday. Yes, so I know. I understand the situation, teacher. But ni modo. <laughs> you could oh, you could uh, our plans for today. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't worry. Also, my plans. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Also, my plan. How are you, teacher? I'm fine, thanks. A little, How was your day? A little tired, but I'm fine. How are you? Okay, fine. Uh, I a little tired too, but it's good. Today it was good. Yeah, today is Friday, and the body knows it. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, in my case, I uh, I am going to work tomorrow. You know, I am going to work. Okay. On Saturday. Mm -hmm. I work Saturday all day. Uh, you teach uh, English? Yes. From eight to six, so we have to. <laughs> so it's going to be a beautiful day, too. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yes. I'm going to begin sharing the class. Okay. Nice talking with you. Okay. So good evening, everybody. Let's. Let's begin. Uh, today is August the 27th, and uh, this is our pre-intermediate two class. Uh, the topic for tonight is I'm a real fitness freak. Okay, so in the agenda tonight, we have conversation. I'm a real fitness freak. Questions with how, health and fitness quiz, what did you do last night and the simple past? We're going to introduce the simple past. We're going to begin studying that. The objectives continue to be to discuss health and fitness. Okay, just quickly, what do you remember we studied in the previous class? What did we study yesterday? We studied uh, adverbs and adverbials. Yes, thank you, Alexander. That's true. Adverbs of frequency and adverbials. Mm -hmm. Adverbials of time. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. What else do you remember we studied? About the address. Direct address. Mm -hmm. Hey, you look, you look nice, Mary. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's correct. Okay, something else you remember? Those were the most important things, definitely. Okay, let's continue. We have to begin tonight. We're going to discuss routines and abilities. Routines and abilities. Let's see, volunteers, do you ever play computer games? No, no, you don't. Okay. Alexander, do you ever play computer games? Yes, teacher. Yes, you do. Okay. I, I have played computer games sometimes, <laughs> mm -hmm. but I don't like too much. Uh, Why not? Um, I don't know, and um, I prefer uh, to look for uh, information in the internet, for example, mm -hmm. mm, or watch TV, listen to music. Okay, sometimes you feel like you're wasting your time, right? You're wasting your time and then, but computer games, 
uh, have a purpose. If they relax you and they make you forget about problems, it's okay, right? For what? Maybe a couple of hours, okay? Too much, but 20 minutes, 30 minutes, it's okay. Let's see, what's your favorite game? Um, I don't remember. Um, you don't remember the name of the game. Plans when I was a child, when I was a child, I remember that I played uh, Mortal Kombat in the computer. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I guess Doña Yolanda played it too. No. Mortal no, Mortal Kombat, no. <laughs> <laughs> I play uh, Hudoku and several quizzes in English and in Spanish. <laughs> Very academic <laughs> video games. Yes, okay. There is one that is called Robo, Robo Quiz. It's very interesting. They ask you about different aspects of culture, general culture and uh, different academic topics. Very interesting. Okay, how well did you play the computer game? Did you play it well? In my case, no, because mm, I never, uh, I don't know, gain uh, more than 1,000 uh, points in the game. Mm -hmm. I, I think I am very bad player. <laughs> I am a horrible player. Okay. I cannot Me too, teacher. <laughs> I'm not that, uh, the best player. <laughs> You're not the best player either, okay. Um, I can play solitaire. That's the one that I play, <laughs> the solitaire. Most of the time putting the, the deck in order, right? So but just that, okay. Uh, when do you play it? When do you play a video game? In my case, uh, every day uh, the, the computer, Remember me, uh, the, I don't know, reto del dia. Ah, the challenge of the day. Uh, the challenge of the day. And uh, I play around uh, 6.30, <laughs> 6.30 a.m. to uh, 7 a.m. Okay. It gets your brain active. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's very good. Okay. <laughs> and you, Alexander, how about you? Now I never played uh, in the computer, teacher. Uh, I prefer to play on basketball or soccer on weekends. Ah, yeah, it's much better. Definitely it's much better. Yes. Okay. So how often do you play basketball? Only on weekends uh, because I don't have time on weekdays. Okay. That's that's okay. That's understandable. And how about Don Rafael Dabu? Do you play computer games? Yes, I do. Are you good at that? that? Yeah, more or less. Mm -hmm. I like to play play simulators. Ah, and yes. car simulators. A motorcycle too. Yes. Yes. Yeah, and they are interesting. I always crash, but they are nice. Yes. Okay. How about you, Noemi? Do you play video games? No, teacher. I don't play computer video games. Uh, why not? Uh, I don't like. Okay. You don't have time or you don't like, but you don't like it. Okay. Yeah. Yes. And what do you play? Do you play? Uh, Table games? No. In my free time, I like to do a handicraft. Oh, okay. Yeah. What kind? Um, Necklace? Handicraft or paper. Uh, butterflies, flowers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yep. interesting. 
Yes. Okay, that's wonderful because that is very creative. Okay. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. Thank you for sharing. Okay, let's move on. Thank you for sharing. Exercise one, conversation. I'm a real fitness freak. The purpose is to discuss fitness. Listen and practice. You're, great. You're in great shape, Keith. Thanks, I guess I'm a real fitness freak. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobics twice a week and I play tennis every week. Tennis, that sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Um, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Well, all right, but I'm not very good. No problem, I'll give you a few tips. Okay, so some words to pay attention to. Great, great shape, fitness freak, workout, aerobics, twice a week. Sounds like a lot of fun. Play some time, pretty well, I guess. Not very good. All right, I'll give you a few tips. Okay, very good. Now, uh, I need volunteers to practice the dialogue. Who would like to? Okay, I have two volunteers. Me, teacher. Noemi and Yolanda Cativo. Okay. And then I heard on Rafael in the next round. Okay. So let's begin. Who begins? Noemi begins. And uh, Doña Yolanda continues. Okay. Okay. You're in great shape, Keith. Thanks. I guess I am a real fitness freak. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobics twice a week and I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Uh, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Well, all right, but I'm not very good. No problem, I'll give you a few tips. Wonderful, excellent, good job. Okay, now Don Rafael Dabu is Keith. We need someone to be Ruth. Karina Lisette, thank you very much. Okay, so Karina is Ruth and Don Rafael is Keith. Okay, you may be. You're in great shape, Kate. Thanks, I guess. <clears throat> I'm a real fitness brick. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobic twice a week and I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Oh, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Well, all right, but I'm not, I can't see. Very good. Not very good. No problem. I will give you a few tips. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much. Okay, Keith, Keith and Ruth. Okay, um, let's see, two other volunteers. Okay, Don Dagoberto Rodriguez is Keith. Who wants to be Ruth? One lady for Ruth. Okay, uh, Doña Yolanda Cativo is, is going to be Ruth. You are in great shape, Kate. Thanks. I guess I am a real fitness freak. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobics twice a week. 
and I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Mm, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Well, all right, but I am not very good. No problem. I will give you a few tips. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Only two more people and we move on. Don Cesar Oviedo, Keith. And uh, let me see. Doña Vanessa de Los Angeles Calito, Ruth. Okay, teacher. Thanks. Okay. Uh, uh, you are in great shape, Kate. Thanks. Uh, Wes, I am really training free. Okay. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobic twice a week and play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot, a lot of fun. <laughs> Uh, do you want to play some time? Uh, how well do you play? Pretty well, I was. Well, all right, but I'm not very good. No problems. I'm giving you a free time. Tips? I'll give you a free, few tips. tips. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, twice, twice a week. Guess, I guess, right? I guess, ge, guess, I guess, okay? And let me see, I guess that's it. All right, excellent. No more volunteers, then let's move on, okay? Questions with how. Okay, we have, we're going to be practicing four different types of questions with how. How often, how well, how good, and how long. How often talks about frequency, okay? So this is about the frequency. You are asking about how frequently something is done okay let me see the tool has to activate yes frequency how long is a total time we can say length of time length of time okay so for an hour for two minutes for 30 minutes for 50 minutes how long right how often every day twice a week three times a week how long for an hour for two hours for 30 minutes how well we're talking about expertise okay expertise so you're asking if the person is an expert or if the person doesn't have much experience playing okay how well do you play tennis pretty well okay and how good how good is with the verb to be how good are you means uh, also expertise right so only that this is a little difference in the sense that the verb is different. For example, how often do you work out? Every day. How often do you work out? Twice a week. How often do you work out? Not very often. How long do you spend at the gym? 30 minutes a day, two hours a week, or about an hour on weekends. How long? Okay, how long is the movie? 
two hours, okay? So how long, how much time, right? How much time do you spend at the gym? With what frequency do you work out? So frequency, how often, how often do you work out? How much time do you spend at the gym? How long do you spend at the gym? How well do you play tennis? Okay, means uh, how well asks about if you play well, if you play badly, how, okay? How well? How well do you play tennis? Pretty well, about average, not very well. And how good uh, asks about the same about expertise, except that you use the verb to be. How good are you at sports? How good are you at cooking? How good are you at driving? How good are you at typing? So, and you, you may answer pretty good. Okay, not so good. How good are you at sports? Pretty good. How good are you at driving? Okay. And how good are you at uh, typing? Mm, not so good. Okay, so these are the four questions with how. Now let's practice. How well do you cook? How well do you cook? How long do you study? So you say, how well do you cook? I cook very well. How long do you cook for two hours? How well do you cook? Mm, my food is delicious. Okay, so the, this would be for this and the other is with a different verb. How good are you at cooking? Okay. Let's see, discuss the following questions. Volunteer for number one. How do you complete this one? Just look at the answer and predict the question. I guess I'm pretty good. I often play on weekends. So what's the question? Yes, Noemi? How good Excellent. are you at volleyball? Very good, yes. How good are you? Excellent. How good are you at volleyball? I guess I'm pretty good. I often play on weekends. Yes, that's nice. Okay, what about number two? Volunteer for two? Who would like to do two? Yes, Don Cesar Oviedo. Uh, how long do you spend online? Okay, how long do you spend online? Very good. Excellent, very good. How about three? One volunteer for three? How often do you play cards? Okay, how often do you play cards? Very good. Yes, very good. How often do you play cards? Once or twice a month. It's a very, it's a good way to relax. Yes, Karina, number four. Thanks. How well do you type? Yes, very good. That's correct. How well do you type? Wonderful. Not very well, actually. I need to take a typing class. How about number five? I have a question. Yes, please, Don Rafael, ask. Uh, and the platform, uh, the question, how well do you type is incorrect. No, no, no very good. I don't know. It doesn't, it doesn't accept it? 
the question is equal. Okay, so you you type how well do you type? Yes, how do well do you type? And uh, the platform marks it as wrong. Answer is different. Oh, the answer? Yeah, of course. These are only examples. Know, excuse me, excuse me, it's equal to two. Not very well, actually. I need to take a typing class. No, these are original questions. They are different from the platform. Uh -huh. They are only for you to get, to get the idea so that when you do the ones in the platform, you have the concept so that you don't copy and paste, but you have the general concept, how to use it, right? So that is the idea. I don't know if that answers your question. Does that answer your question? Okay. Yes, Dr. Rafael. How well do you play soccer? Excellent, very good, yes. Mm, you didn't write, okay. How well do you play soccer? Well, very well, actually. I'm the star of the team. Very modest, right? This child is very modest, okay? I'm the star of the team, okay? Okay, excellent. This is only trying out. Now the next one. Instructions. Insert the words well, often, long or good in the right place in the sentence, okay? Uh, how can you decide if you need well, often, long or good? Just look at the answer. The answer will dictate what word you need to use. Well, often, long or good. Okay, number one, volunteer for one. Often. Okay, uh, we're going to be reading the complete sentences, okay? So I have a... How, how often do you go jogging? How often do you go jogging? Excellent, very good. Thank you. He didn't write, let me see. Yes, Noemi? How often does Mary go to Paris? Once a week. Okay, excellent, once a week. How often? Wonderful. Another volunteer? How long do you spend at the gym? About two hours. Perfect. Yes, very good. How long? Okay, wonderful. How about number four? Volunteer for four? How long does my sister go out? Excellent, yes, very good. How long does my sister go out? All day, okay. Number five, volunteer for five. How, How well long? does my brother play soccer? Uh, Pretty well. Excellent, very good. How well does my brother play soccer? Pretty well. How well, wonderful. Number six, volunteer for six. Yes, Noemi, again. How long does my father watch TV? For three or four hours? Yes, that's correct. Very good, how long? Okay, now number seven. How long do you play with your friends? For three hours. Okay, excellent. How long? Now, yes, don, don Cesar Oviedo. 
Uh, how well do they dance? Very well. Yes, very good. How well do they dance? Very well. Number nine. Don Dagoberto Rodriguez, number nine. How often do we have class? Exactly, every day. very good. Yes, how often do we have class? Every day. Okay, number 10. How often do they go to the movies? Very good. How often do they go to the movies? Okay. Number 11, volunteer for 11. How often do they go to church? Okay, excellent. Very good. How often do they go to church? Okay, number 12. How well does he play basketball? Mm -hmm. Very well. Yes, correct. How well does he play basketball? Very well. Number 13. How good is done at cooking? He's the best chef I know. Perfect, yes. How good. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And the last one. How good is Mary at dancing? She dances very well. Yeah, very good. How good is Mary at dancing? Okay. Excellent. Do you have any questions about how well, how often, how long, and how good? No. No, teacher. No questions. Okay. Fantastic. Now we're going to see one that is a famous question, sometimes difficult for some people. Is how long does it take you to Okay, how long does it take you to take a shower? How long does it take you to take a shower? And the answer normally, okay, you normally answer it takes- Every, every day. <laughs> how long? And you say, it takes me 20 minutes. 30 minutes. Okay, or 30 minutes. Takes me. If I am late in 10 minutes. Oh, okay. Or no shower at all, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Every day I take a shower. Yeah, of course. Sure, because it is necessary to take a shower every day. Yeah. Okay. So it takes me, and you say 20 minutes. Okay. Not. Uh -huh. Okay, 20 minutes. Okay, see, this would be the answer. Normally you answer with it takes me. Okay. How long does it take you to come to class? It takes me two minutes. Yes, teacher, I only open Zoom and I am in class. Okay. How long does it take you? Okay, let me see. Don Dagoberto Rodriguez, how long does it take you to shave? Teacher, what is shave? Shave. 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 Uh, it I takes me... 15 minutes. 15 minutes, okay. 10, 10 or 15 minutes. 10 or 15 minutes, okay. Señorita Marina Sanabria, how long does it take you to brush your teeth? Excuse me, teacher, can you repeat me, please? 
gladly, happily, no problem. How long does it take you to brush your teeth? Uh, okay. I take five minutes. It takes me five minutes, okay. Very good. Let's see. Eh, señorita Vanessa de Los Angeles Calito. How often does it take you to cook? To cook lunch? To prepare lunch? It takes me one hour it, or more. <laughs> takes you an hour or more it takes yes it takes you an hour or more it, yes yes sorry <laughs> don't worry it's okay <laughs> okay nice then we have the alexander marroquin how long does it take you uh, to do your regular exercise Yeah. About 30 minutes. About 30 minutes. It takes, you, it takes you about 30 minutes. Okay, excellent. Very good. Um, let me see. What about Noemi? How long does it take you to go shopping? Um, usually, I don't go shopping because I when I go, it takes me 30 minutes or one hour, it depends. It depends if you are shopping for a bag or if you are food shopping. Normally I go to the supermarket. Uh -huh. Okay. And it takes you 30 minutes. Um, yeah. Okay, very good. That's nice. Now Don Rafael Dabu. How long does it take you to play a tennis match? It takes me one hour. An hour, okay, excellent, very good. Don Cesar Oviedo, how long does it take you to study the lesson? Uh, I usually one hour every day. An hour, okay, excellent, very nice. And Don Walter Vasquez, how long does it take you to get ready to go to work? I take me 30 minutes. It takes you 30 minutes. Okay, that's nice. Very good. Okay. Uh, Doña Milagro Mira, how often does it take you to prepare breakfast? Okay, nobody there, nobody home. Let's see. The question is how yes, often? Repeat. Sorry? Your question is how often? Uh, how long? How long, how, long? how long does it take you to prepare breakfast? Uh, how long? In my case, uh, 30 minutes. All right. Mm -hmm. Very good. Good breakfast. Good breakfast. In 30 minutes, you prepare a good breakfast. For my husband and um, for me, uh, for my daughter. <laughs> okay. yeah. Breakfast for three in one, two, three, five, 30 minutes. Okay. Excellent. Very good. That's wonderful. All right. Thank you very much, my dear ones. Let's move on. Teacher, I have a question. Yes. What is the difference how well and how good? Oh, the, the, the same. The difference is, okay, the meaning is basically the same. The difference is the, the structure, right? How well does he play? Okay, how good is? You, good is with the verb to be, and well is does in another verb. How well do you cook? I cook very well. How well do you dance? I dance very well. But how good are you at dancing? 
How good are you at cooking? How good are you at uh, playing a sport? Right? That's the difference between the two. Okay. When I use good, I use there to be and well, the auxiliary. The auxiliary and another verb. That's he. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Yes. How well do you play soccer? How good are you at playing soccer? Right? How well do you cook? How good are you at cooking? Mm -hmm. That would be the difference. Okay, excellent. Let's move on. Exercise three, health and fitness quiz. Okay, let's see. Uh, I'm going to ask some people, you may think about your answers to select a different tool for this one. Let's see. How many meals do you eat each day? Teacher, what's a meal? Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Those are meals. Okay. So some people have a, a meal between lunch and dinner, right? At three o'clock, four o'clock, you have a, a meal. Okay. So how many meals do you eat each day? Vanessa, how many meals do you eat each day? I have three meals. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yes. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you very much. Three meals. Don Dagoberto Rodriguez, how often do you eat at regular times during the day? Okay, teacher, what is a regular time? Seven o'clock in the morning, 12.30, and uh, 6.30 p.m. or 7 p.m. Those would be regular times. How often do you eat at regular times during the day? I usually eat at regular times during the day. Wonderful, thank you. Noemi, how many servings of fruits and vegetables do you eat? each day? None. None. No vegetables, no fruit. Um, sometimes vegetable, uh -huh. but fruit is not common in my, in my meals. Okay. You don't like fruit? Uh, so, so. Mm -hmm. Not so much. You prefer vegetables? Yeah. And particularly potatoes? Um, broccoli. Broccoli. Uh, carrot. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, potatoes. My Vegetable pears with skillets, right? Oh, yeah. Vegetable pears. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Well, let's see. Don Rafael, how much junk food do you eat? Oh, junk food. Junk food is hamburgers, pizza hot dogs, mm -hmm. how much junk food do you eat? Very little, about average, a lot. Okay. Don Rafael is not with us right now. Okay, change the question to another person. Uh, Doña Yolanda Cativo, how often or how much junk food do you eat? Very little. Difficult. Very little. Oh, very little. Okay, I thought very difficult question. Okay. No, no, no. Very little. Very little. Okay. Let's see. Uh, Kari, yes? Peter, I have a question. Please ask. I would like to understand what's the meaning of about average. Oh, about average. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Let me see. Mm. 
Okay, let's imagine that you have in the first exam, in the first exam, you have uh, eight. In the second exam, you study more and you have 10. Mm. But say, then you say, ah, I have 10 in the other exam and I have eight, I already passed. And you study less and you have nine. And then you add eight, 10 and nine and your average is nine. That is your, okay, eight plus 10, 18 plus nine, 27. Divided into three or divided okay. by three, nine. Uh -huh. um, that okay, thank okay. you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Okay, Karina, do you take vitamins? What teacher? I do, do you take vitamins? Vitamins, yes. Yes, I, I take vitamin. Every day? Every day. Okay, excellent. So we mark yes, every day. Okay, wonderful. Let's see. Don Cesar, how often do you exercise or play sport? Uh, one or mm, no, usually never. <laughs> usually never. You want to be honest with the answer, okay? Never. All right. Excellent. Thank you very much. Now, next question. Let's see. This is for. Jennifer Martinez, which best describes your exercise program? Um, none. None, okay. So we mark none. Let me see that this, I'm going to put it at the bottom because it blocks my marking. Okay. Yes. All right. Excellent. Now let's see number eight. Mm -hmm. Don Alexander Marroquin, how important is your fitness program to you? Um. It's very important uh, the my fitness program very for me, important. for my health. Excellent, very good. Thank you very much. And number nine, Don Dagoberto Rodriguez, which best describes your weight? Within six pounds of your ideal weight, within 10 pounds of your ideal weight, or more than 12 pounds of your ideal weight? Uh, with the six pounds of my ideal weight. Ideal weight, okay. There is the question, the answer is not here, but you can say, hey, teacher, what happens to you? I'm in my ideal weight. <laughs> okay, so you can say that too. Let's see, number 10, Senorita Man Marina Sanabria. How often do you get a physical exam? Daily. Daily? How do you say? Uh, daily. Daily. Rarely. 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 Okay. Rarely. Rarely. Okay. You don't have time. Okay. Inside, yes, I forget. You it's forget. It's necessary. Yeah. Sometimes. I know it's necessary. <laughs> Yeah, you know, sometimes we have to go to work and sometimes we don't have time. So yes. another situation. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Let's see. Uh, okay. 
do you, Yolanda Cativo? How often do you sleep well? Always. Always. Good yes. conscience. Good conscience. Yes. Uh -huh. Now you know yes. you're very tired, you're very tired. You just touch the, your head touches the pillow and bye-bye. This Except when, when my husband touch me. <laughs> oh, that's another story. Except. That's another story. Okay, good. Say so too much information. Ah, too much information. <laughs> now that's wonderful. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Now, one volunteer for number 12. How long do you usually sleep? Or seven hours. Okay, eight or eight or seven hours. No, six or seven hours. Or seven hours. Okay. Yes, it's all right. Eight or seven hours is perfect. Okay, that is a good one. Okay. So the questions are: How many meals do you eat each day? Possible answers: Four or five meals a day. Three meals. One or two meals. How often do you eat at regular times during the day? Almost always, usually, or hardly ever. How many servings of fruits or vegetables do you eat each day? Five or more, one to four, none. How much junk food do you eat? Very little, about average, or a lot. Do you take vitamins? And you say, yes, every day, sometimes, or no, I don't need them, okay? How often do you exercise or play a sport? Three or more days a week, one or two days a week, or never. Which best describes your exercise program? Weight training and aerobics? Weight training or aerobics, only one or the other, or none at all? How important is your fitness program to you? Very important, fairly important, not very important. Which best describes your weight? Within six pounds of my ideal weight, within 10 pounds of my ideal weight, or more than 12 pounds of my ideal weight? Oh, in my case, I can say more than 24 pounds of my ideal weight. Let's see, number 10. How often do you get a physical exam? Once a year, every two or three years, or rarely? How often do you sleep well? Always, usually, or sometimes, or hardly ever or never. I have nightmares, okay? How long do you usually sleep? Eight hours or more, six or seven hours, less than six hours. Okay, very good. This, this is the quiz. Now let's move to, that is to finish a uh, modulo uno, okay? And we get to modulo two, okay? Peter. Yes. I have no, and another question. Please go ahead. Uh, what ways we can use for save our answer in the platform? In the last test. Okay, in the last test, uh -huh. which ways can you choose? Yeah, you choose because I remember the the test is about uh, our uh, these questions, mm -hmm. our answer. But uh, I remember that said I need to write in the answers. Oh, no, you don't need, well, in this one, in this test, no. And probably in the platform is modified. And then, uh, okay, if you need to write, you can write the, one of these options. No, uh, I, I don't know how to explain to you. But I remember that in the platform, the platform said, say that we need to write the answer in the notebook. Mm. 
Oh, okay. Probably they need you to calculate. Yeah. High, your fitness level, your health, right? So right. You, that's why you need, they give you points. Three points, four points. Here, yeah. I didn't write that. I didn't write points or anything, but yes. If you, if they give you three or four points for, imagine that here, very important, five points, fairly important, three points, not very important, no points. Then if you are counting, you calculate, you add and you write the number, right? Yeah. Maybe that's what they are asking. Okay. And the next, and what that is a hunger in the platform is the question. And uh, I don't know activities. Oh, okay. My question is, uh, which ways do we need to use for save our answer in the platform? Saving. Yeah. Oh, no saying, saving. Saving. Okay, for saving? Yes. Once you finish, you submit. Submit. If you submit the answers, it is saved. For That's example, my score was 33 points. <laughs> Okay, so you have 43 points. Yeah. Uh -huh. You can say that my score is 43 points. Only score, sorry, sorry. Uh -huh. Okay, I guess only the score you write. But let me check, let me check and I will have a definite answer on Monday, okay? Okay. On Monday, I can tell you about the Okay, because to be honest, right now I don't remember. Okay, but I will have a definite answer on Monday. Okay, thank you. Sure, I promise. Okay, let's see. In their free time, read, watch TV, spend time with family, fish, do gardening, play sports go to the movies and spend time with friends. Which of these activities do you do in your free time? Okay. Noemi, which of these activities do you do in your free time? You Normally, can... I spend time in doing handicraft and, and with my family sometimes. Okay. So, yes, you can say I spend time with my family and I do handicraft. Yeah. Sometimes I read, you can say, or I do gardening, or sometimes I spend time with friends, or I go to the movies. Okay, sometimes I play sports or I, okay, or I go fishing. So let's see, Don Dagoberto Rodriguez, what, what activities do you do in your free time? I'm, I'm read, uh, watch TV and spend time with family. Okay, excellent, very good, that's nice. How about Don, Don Oviedo? Uh, me, teacher? Yes. Ah, in my free time, I read in the boot or in computer digital, or my li I like the newspaper read. Oh, it's fantastic. To read the newspaper. Which newspaper do you read? Yes, it's my hobby. Uh, which newspaper? Ah, uh, is the in the national uh, uh, or more 
local or exterior <laughs> diario de hoy la gráfica the new york times the los angeles times or eh, el diario de salvador el yes sí. or the diario de Okay, New York Times, Chicago Tri Tribune, Miami Herald. Okay, yes, all right, very good, that's nice. Okay, let's see. Vanessa, what do you do in your free time? Uh, I draw ah, you in know. my free time. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. Yes, you're an artist is too. Okay. <laughs> How good are you at painting? What? How good are you at painting? Painting? Mm, yes. You you are good at um more or less. <laughs> okay. About average. Okay, excellent. Yeah. That's nice. Wonderful. Okay, thanks for sharing. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Okay. Let's see. How about, let me see. We are very few. Uh, Doña Yolanda Cativo, what do you do in your free time? I read, watch TV, and spend time with my family and my dogs. Oh, how many dogs do you have? nine dogs wow. all of them are rescue dogs oh, oh, all of them uh, are rescue dogs. rescue dogs and what not more dogs <laughs> because i don't have any money <laughs> you, i have uh, 17 turtles rescued too okay yeah. they are uh -huh. Okay. Turtles. Turtles, yes. Different type. Uh -huh. Pulcherima and okay, from the woods. Turtles from the woods, uh, from Miami, from Nicaragua, from different places. They are nice turtles. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thanks for sharing. Let's move on. Conversation. Okay. Did you do anything special? Okay, let me see. I'm going to move the bar again. I think I have, a, Karina has a question. Please go ahead. Or oh, you are a volunteer. Okay, it says, so what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did, did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you, did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere at all, I mean, all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today? I forgot all about that. Don't worry, you always get an A. Okay, I have... Karina is one volunteer. I need another volunteer. Yes? yes. Okay. Yes. Noemi, begin, please. Okay. So what did you, what did you do last weekend, man? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to the lockers? No, we didn't. We went to that the new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today. I forgot all about that. Don't worry, you always get an A. Excellent, very good, that's nice, thanks. Okay, then Doña Yolanda Cativo is Meg and Don Rafael is Rick. Teacher Don Rafael left. 
some time ago. Okay, then Don Dagoberto Rodriguez. Don Dagoberto Rodriguez okay. and Meg is Doña Yolanda Cativo. Okay. So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? So, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I used to stay home and study for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today? I forgot all about that. Don't worry. You always get an A. Excellent, wonderful. Thank you very much. Now, two other volunteers. Okay. I have uh, Don Cesar Oviedo and Karina Lisette. Okay, Karina is Meg and uh, Don Cesar Oviedo is Rick. Okay, begin. Okay. So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh. I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like home. Did you go to Lucas? No, we didn't. We went to the, that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today. I forgot all about that. Don't worry, you always get an E. An A, uh -huh. you always get an A. Okay, excellent, wonderful. Two more people and with this we finish. Okay. Two volunteers. Okay, Meg is Vanessa de Los Angeles Calito. And Don Alexander is Please begin. Okay. Don Alexander begins, right? Yes. So what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Loki's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today? I forgot all about that. Don't worry, you always get an A. Okay, wonderful, excellent, very good, good job. All right, my friend. Thank friends. you. Thank today, you. Yes, today's we study the. Okay, we began with the discussion of uh, routines and activities and abilities, then the conversation. I'm a real fitness freak and move on to questions with how, okay? How well, how good, how long, okay? We did some practice about that. Then we worked on health and fitness quiz, okay? We answered the questions and we began with discussing free time activities and we finished with the conversation. Okay, tonight, this is it, okay? We're going to stop here. Now you can go to sleep finally. It's the end of the week. Thank you very much for your patience. You are wonderful. Thank you for your participation. I understand uh, we didn't want to steal your time this Friday, but it was a necessity, okay? Because we needed to have four uh, days this week, okay? I don't take you any more time. God bless you all. Take care of yourselves. I'll be seeing you. 
Thank you, teacher. Thank you, Thank teacher. You, teacher. Yeah, thank you, too. Enjoy Likewise. your weekend. See you soon. Take care, okay? See you on Monday. Take care, my friends. Bye.